as students wanted to have a conversation about identity here at the college. And so students were invited then to sort of use six words to say who they are, how they want to be identified, or how they don't want to be identified. And we collected, you know, over 500 uh, sheets of paper with students' six word stories. Not to mention we opened up marker boards at the library in our student center where students could write anonymously their six word stories. And we used our different sort of approaches and theories from religious studies to think about the six word story campaign and all that that meant or all that means to the community and what it says about the community. And it was up to them to sort of tell us what that data means. I think what we're realizing in this country is that we have serious fault lines um, across issues of race and identity and, and other ma matters. We are also not very well versed at how to talk about them. Um, we've done a really good job of covering it up. You know, King had a dream, let's move on. Institutions have to be at the forefront of having those conversations before things reach a boiling point when you have to yell in order to make your voice heard. I mean, what we're seeing is not a problem we're seeing the reality that students have to get on lunch tables in a lot of spaces to make their voices heard. Uh, so my challenge to everyone, this campus, every campus across the country, is to say, okay, let's create that space, let's make things happen, and let's do it together.